Today, we're going to take a quick update on three popular companies, NVIDIA, Snowflake, and Microsoft. Snowflake has actually partnered up with those two other players to increase kind of its large language model solutions. And I think it's pretty interesting how Snowflake is going in two different directions at the same time. I'll explain a little bit more in today's episode. All right, so we obviously have to start with NVIDIA, a fan favorite and my number one company in my portfolio. Um, NVIDIA recently announced a partnership with Snowflake. So so Snowflake, the data cloud company, and NVIDIA today announced at Snowflake Summit 2023 that they are partnering to provide businesses of all size with accelerated path to create customized generative AI applications using their own proprietary data, all secured within Snowflake Data Cloud. So right off the bat, we can definitely see how both these players are in this, right? Um, NVIDIA has created a lot of different uh, AIs and LM, LLM creation solutions and snowflake thanks to kind of their data storage to some to kind of break it down easily uh, makes it a very great partner up and one thing that we have been hearing a lot in the tech field is maybe companies are not going to go out there and create or get these crazy huge large language models what they're going to end up doing is kind of creating their own large language models based on their own data so this makes sense and it kind of is really following trend with what the market is seeing so they are mentioning that they are going to be using nvidia's nemo a platform for developing large language models and nvidia gpu accelerated computing snowflake will enable enterprises to use data in their snowflake accounts to make custom llms for advanced generative ai services including chatbots search and summarization the ability to customize these large language models without moving data enables proprietary information to remain fully secured and governed within the snowflake platform and that's the big thing here right it's kind of creating your large language model with your own data and being fe and and making sure that that proprietary is yours that information is yours right so you don't have to worry about any form of security so i think this is a very interesting move we're seeing how both players can win big here right so how can snowflake win big here right it kind of showcases to other nvidia players out there that hey if i want to maybe create my own large language model and kind of have my own proprietary data and kind of store it in a pretty cool system i would probably probably work with a company like Snowflake, right? And then if you are a Snowflake company customer already and you're really kind of looking at the AI space and kind of these large language models, with a partnership like this, it kind of throws NVIDIA in the forefront, right? It kind of shows NVIDIA's Nemo, the, this kind of platform for developing large language models. But NVIDIA has so many other solutions. So all these customers of Snowflakes that are going to be using these large language models, their software engineers are going to be learning a little bit more about NVIDIA's back end about nvidia's different platform solutions and that overall in my opinion is going to increase this kind of ecosystem or the attention of this ecosystem that nvidia has announced so i do believe this is a good win for both nvidia and snowflake i want to thank the motley fool for sponsoring this video and check out fool.com slash jose for the 10 best stocks to buy now with that link you get a promotional offer for the subscription service now, let's continue with today's episode. Um, we did hear from Jensen Hung, the founder and CEO of NVIDIA, that data is essential to creating generative AI applications that understand the complex operations and unique voice of every company. And that's what's very important, right? Every company is different because of the data. Together, NVIDIA and Snowflake will create an AI factory that helps enterprises turn their own valuable data into custom generative AI models to power ground breaking new applications right from the cloud platform that they use to run their businesses and they do mention that nvidia and snowflake's collaborate collaboration represents a new opportunity for enterprises it will enable them to use their proprietary data which can range from hundreds of terabytes to petabytes of raw and curated business information to create and fine-tune custom large language models that power business specific applications and services so i, I mean i personally think this is a great move like i mentioned how i talked that this is a great win for both snowflake and nvidia and it kind of showcases that big businesses are really moving or businesses in general are really moving right now to kind of create their own large language model to maybe improve one aspect of their business another thing that they mention is 
these the companies will also be using Nemo Guardrail, which is a software solutions that developers can use to ensure that their applications or these chat box and everybody else aligns with business specific topics, safety and security requirements. Right. Let's say you go to a company that sells food and you start asking it about political questions. It's not going to answer those political questions because of Nemo Guardrails, because it kind of they it makes sure that these LLMs and these chat box and everything else stay on target of what they're supposed to be doing. So pretty good move there, and especially with Snowflake, right? It, with this way, Snowflake is kind of allowing large lang- companies that want to create proprietary large language models an easy enough solution. But what if you want to do it another way? What if maybe you don't really care too much about that proprietary information and you still want to kind of create these large language models? And I think this is where the next partnership that Snowflake announced is pretty interesting. So Snowflake, again, on the same day, announced an expanded partnership with Microsoft, enabling new product integrations across AI, low-code, no-code application development, data conference, and more. So with this partnership, Snowflake will expand its strategic initiatives with Microsoft to empower data scientists and developers with industry-leading AI solutions, building new integrations between the data cloud and Azure machine learning, and leverage integrations with Azure OpenAI and Microsoft Cognitive Services. Additionally, to leverage the latest in AI innovation to build intelligent data products, both companies are committed to working toward enabling Snowflake customers to easily and securely leverage Azure, I'm pretty sure I'm butchering that, OpenAI and Microsoft's cognitive service with Snowflake data. So, I, I mean, obviously, we're still talking a little bit more securely here, um, but it does seem like maybe this route might be for companies that maybe want to get a little bit more information from out there, maybe use a little bit more solutions from OpenAI's kind of API solutions and OpenAI's um, uh, solutions that are out there. So I think um, Snowflake is actually really smart with this move. It seems like this AI and machine and large language model direction that they're going with the kind of data that the customers have can go into two different directions. You can go with this kind of NVIDIA partnership and work with the NVIDIA Nemo to kind of create maybe your own application, your own large language models, or in the other hand, you can go with maybe the Microsoft route where maybe a lot of the building blocks might have already been created. Maybe a little bit more data might be in there because you're using that API. So it is pretty interesting to see the two directions that NVIDIA and that Snowflake is going. I'm personally not an investor of Snowflake. I market capital for roughly $56 billion. If you are a Snowflake investor, let me know in the comments below. Do you think this is super bullish for the company or is pretty much no news. I personally enjoy it more on the NVIDIA side. I definitely see how Microsoft can win, but I do believe this is going to continue to expand NVIDIA's ecosystem to the public. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. Take care, have a good day, and see you next time.